By spring 1948, with the complete victory of the People's Revolution led by the Communist Party of China a foregone conclusion, the establishment of New China started to become a reality. On April 30, 1948, the Central Committee of the CPC issued May 1 slogans in which it called on to quickly convene a political consultative conference to discuss and realize the establishment of a democratic coalition government. Over 350 democratic activists arrived in liberated areas in seven groups from September 1948 to March 1949. On the afternoon of March the 25th, Mao Zedong and other leaders arrived at Beiping's Xiyuan Airport. In Beiping, Mao Zedong reached out far and wide for advice on establishing the new China from patriotic democratic activists. Song Qingling arrived in Beiping on August 28, 1949. The CPPCC had its first plenary session on September the 21st. On September the 29th, the meeting adopted the common program of the CPPCC, which clearly stipulated that the new China's state system was the People's Democratic Dictatorship and its system of government was the People's Congress. Before the 1954 constitution, this common program served as a provisional constitution.